One, two, three hundred. If you didn't catch that, that was 300. Yeah, like I said, boys, if you practice, then you'll be able to do 7.5, 7.5, 2.5, 2.5. Wait, 15, 20, 20. so 40. Be able to do 40 pounds. Just easy, yeah. See, yesterday I was doing fives, now I'm all at the 40. You see how much, you know, doing that can help? I recommend it. I highly do. Anyways, on another note, you see this? King Henry, really respectable man and stuff, right? Okay, wait. What you see right up to cannon, that last line there, it says cannon. That's everything I memorized up to. Well, I had memorized up to. Yesterday I looked it over and I knew um, some of the lines. I woke up this morning and like when I was on the bus and everything, actually, I actually went on the wrong bus today, which was a total complete disaster because I'm running late and then I, I, I'm waiting at the bus stop and the first bus I see, I hop on it right away, right? I just want to pop, get on there so I can hurry up and get to school before I end up being late. Turns out it was the wrong bus. It took me in a wrong route. So I had to get off at some random stop. I'm walking around for a while. Like, I have no idea where I'm going. Oh. I'm like, I wish I had a phone right now so I could text someone or Google map it, right? So I like walked down until I could find a place where it actually uh, was actually open and there's people in there, not just a random house, right? So, so I walked and then I walked into some barber shop. I'm like, uh, do you guys know where the Canada Line station is or Canby Street or whatever? And the guy was like, no. I'm like, uh, Okay, thanks anyways, and then this other guy's like, no, no, uh, you can't be street. Yeah, it's about four blocks that way. So I'm like, okay, thank you. So I start walking and walking and oh, man, it's like such a long walk. And this whole time I'm sitting here trying to memorize this more and more and more. I get to school and what I know is once more into the breach, dear friends, once more. Or close the wall up with our English dead. In peace there's nothing so becomes a man as modest stillness and humility. But when the blast of war blows in our ears, then imitate the action of the tiger. Stiffen the sinews, summon up the blood, disguise fair nature with hard favored rage. Then lend the eye a terrible aspect. Let pry through the portage of the head like the brass cannon. That was memorized at the end of the day. like. I had like an hour more do it and I was cooking food and I'm sitting there going over this and I burnt my finger, this one right here, and it hurts, it's really tender. I don't know, it hurts a lot though. And anyways, I'm going through this the whole time and I thought I'm going to let my brain have a break now. Okay, so I watched some videos on YouTube uh, of how your brain is deceived by perception, by shadows, by sound and other stuff. It was pretty fascinating actually. So I watched two segments of it, each one was 15 minutes. So then before looking at this again, I walked up, walked to that side of the room, and then I went once more into the breach, dear friends, once more. Or walls, close them, English, dead. So I came over here, looked at the first line, or close the wall, I'm like, okay, or close the wall up with their English dead. In peace, there's nothing so but. And I knew how it was gonna somewhat be, uh, there's nothing so. There's nothing. Humility. Crap! 
So becomes a man as modest stillness and humility. You know what? Two days ago, or like we've had memorized uh, Hamlet speak the speech I pray you as I pronounce it to you, trippingly on the tongue. I can memorize all that and I can almost do it in one breath. So it's from speak the speech I pray you all the way to it out Herod's Herod, pray you avoid it. I can pretty much do that in one breath. I stop uh, my breath when I have to <gasps> breathe in at um, I would have such a fellow wit for or doing termagant it out Herod's Herod, pray you avoid it. I can pretty much do the whole thing except for that. And I can't get this after half an hour. Oh, I've been practicing for maybe three hours. I feel like I can't accomplish this at all. I'm, I'll try for another hour, but I don't know if I want to give more than that. If I can't get it, I'll just have to talk to Adrian tomorrow. Ugh, this is brutal though. I'm really disappointed in myself. But anyways, my question, you guys gave me one. I'm your favorite person. I'm your favorite thing. Yay. In this life, the next, and forevermore. <laughs> Apparently. And for me, my free, th my th free, free. I want to talk about free. Uh, my three favorite things are God, family, friends. Sometimes it's hard to determine which one, family or friends, which one would I rather be with. A lot of the times I'd rather be with my friends, right? But now I actually wouldn't mind a home cooked meal again. Although today I made excellent, or yesterday I made excellent chicken. Ah, so good. I made my special, I made some hot sauce thing that go over it. I don't know what I did. I just threw some stuff together. Hopefully it worked and it did. Ah, it was great. Um, I'm going to be selfish today. Instead of asking you guys a question, I'm going to ask you guys if you guys can help me with some memorizing techniques because I got none. At least not for that. I, I can memorize other things, but that's a little bit harder. Thanks for watching. We be studying hard.